So the madness really came from the obsession of wanting to showcase my designer blood. When somebody like Tree comes up with an idea, it's really grandiose and there's lots of different ways that you can capture it. It's hard to capture what she's thinking and put it into photography so that everybody can enjoy. That's my job as the photographer. Omar, Omar had really, he had reached out to me and was like, hey B, um, I got this opportunity with Tree. And I was like, okay, cool, tell me about it. I mean, I went to school for this. I really know my stuff. Like, um, you know, get some behind the scenes and edit some stuff together, you know, about, uh, she had like some blood and, um, some clones and some hybrids. I really didn't know what he was talking about. But it was interesting, mm -hmm. and I was all in. I said, let's go, let's do it. Where do we need to meet? The industry term is fatal beauty, so I just kind of made a play on the words and made it fetal beauty because I wanted to start off my story with life and the beauty of life. And so I have a be my beautiful friend Kendall, and she's portraying the fetal beauty, and um, the, re the reason that we have her turned towards camera left is because she starts the series and we wanted to show the beginning of life. It starts in the embryo. So fatal beauty becomes fetal beauty. Okay, so now let's see doll, cutie eye. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. The clone was great because I liked doing the clone look and <laughs> I thought it was nice and and, and um, I thought it was unique. Unique and fun. Plastic surgeon, the futuristic plastic surgeon, that one was a lot of fun. That one I thought showcased my hair and makeup and my special effects all at the same time because it had the blood necklace in there, it had blood on this and the big size syringe not the little one and the hair was beautiful and it looked kind of like Grace Kelly Princess Grace Kelly meets futuristic beautiful plastic surgeon woman um, I liked the makeup so I was all in from the jump it was a great opportunity All the work. <laughs> all these guys did was cut the hell to do was cut the work. They sweat. I did everything. I did hair, makeup, blood. I made the jewelry. I filled every vial, every syringe, every. Oh my god. Yeah. All the guys did that. Cool. All star team, okay. I'm, Mike, I'm Michael. I'm Michael Jordan. Y'all are Kobe Bryant and LeBron. Okay. It is. It's a team. It's a team. It's a team. It's like we come in a team. It's all three of us. This kid. A team, a team effort. Um, they didn't just come to work and push buttons. They came and they had to read my mind. <laughs> they um, had to bring their ideas with them in their own style. And I didn't. I, there were some things that I didn't want to answer. I didn't want to answer questions. I just wanted them to kind of have free reign over certain areas and like them abiding. Tree would just show up and say, "We need this done," and I'm like, "What the hell are you talking about?" <laughs> There's four of us in this team. There's four! <laughs> so what's next? What's the next project? Uh, the next project is to... I gotta shave. That's my next thing. <laughs> yeah. um. uh, what you got going on, Um, I was gonna say let's go get, you know, buy a new distribution.
distribution center together as a team and do series. But... In all seriousness, it really is an honor to be able to work with these two other geniuses in their area of expertise. Um, it, it's, it's very rare when you're able to collaborate with other like-minded individuals that share your passion for creativity. And it, it was a no-brainer, really, to be honest, to be able to work with Trey and Brent on this project. And uh, we just hope that you guys are able to enjoy it. It was so much fun to work with these two amazing souls. They both have the most beautiful energy on set. They're beautiful people, beautiful artists. But more than that, they're friends that I just, I have so, really invested a lot in our friendship. And I hope that they feel like they've invested a lot in the friendship with me as well. Uh, but not just as artists, and, but also as friends. And I think that we have so many things that we can communicate, so many ideas we can show people that we can do everything and it doesn't take a big team it just dedication hard work and determination to get the job done dedication hard work and determination hard dedication get the job done get the job done it was a genius and we did it in two days two days two days it would have been three but I slept I slept what was that? It's creepy like a tub. Uh, my fault there, but yeah, two days. We were able to do it. We had to do it in two days. We had to do it in two days. That's good. I don't know.